<laughs> Welcome back. We're Evan and Caitlin. Certainly, certainly glad you could join us today. After our first Bob Ross video, you guys had so many requests for us to do another one, we decided we'd give it a shot. And today, there's a twist. I will be telling Caitlin all of the instructions. She can't see anything. This is gonna be more of a communication test than a painting test. Also a painting test. Yeah. I actually feel like... Freedom? No, no, Maybe? no. An unwarranted level of confidence <laughs> that I'm gonna have something turn out pretty good. Because our last tutorial turned out great. <laughs> yeah, but also at the same time, you're gonna be doing your own. You know, like Bob Ross says. If well, everyone no, I still painted, want it to look like his. If everyone painted the same painting, what a boring world this would be. I feel like you're just setting yourself up to be a bad communicator. I'm... The goal is to make it look like his. You want the exact same number of trees, the exact same orientation of the path? Like, like everything I want same? you to do your best and I'll do my best. Okay, sounds like a plan. <laughs> this video is sponsored by Squarespace. From websites and online stores to marketing tools and analytics, Squarespace is the all-in-one platform to build a beautiful online presence and run your business. I thought today maybe we'd do a... Let's do a little winter scene, something that's... Let's just see what happens. Let's start with, with black and blue, or blue and black. Kaylin. Yeah? <laughs> this is gonna be really interesting because I think Bob Ross comes up with these paintings on the spot. Your brain doesn't work that way. You no. wanna have the whole vision yes. like beforehand. I think that I can describe it in a way that appeals to your 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 brain and head, but at the same time, you're also very visual. Okay, so there's gonna be four layers. The first is gonna be a gradient from blue, blue here, and then like a slight bit of yellow for like a sun. Or I sorry, don't have yellow. yellow. No, the red, red, red. <laughs> like okay. like okay, faded, okay. like n n nothing like distinct. Like a light blue. Like like no, but like so he he did it all with this black and this blue. It's gonna a be a dark like, blue. But but. Not that, not that dark. <laughs> he somehow made it light and beautiful and airy and fluffy. And I believe in you. Just have a good time with this. Just have a good time with this. So we, we've already had, we already have a layer of liquid white. Yes. And okay. I'm just gonna, so, so just, just paint some happy clouds. We'll just pop in a little. Maybe sky. a little bit more blended than that. I'll blend it just on the canvas. Little spots. I don't want this to be a flat old dead sky. You don't want it to be a flat old dead sky. Flat old dead sky. <laughs> Well, it, seems, it seems so harsh. It seems like there's so much paint on there. Remove, remove all of the paint from your brush. <laughs> okay, well, is this part of the instructions that you need to communicate to me? <laughs> I am, I am. This is going great. Tell you what, maybe we can get a little crazy here. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm like going for here. <laughs> is it, what, what are his strokes like? Is he like tapping? We'll just, we'll just pop in a little stuff. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is this better? <laughs> Is, am I like on track? <laughs> Do I get to beat the devil? Yeah, 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 yeah. Fluffy, soft edges. Is this a live sky or a dead sky? You know what, every sky is different. <laughs> so it's like a, like a, a lighter path in the center middle. Okay. Yeah. You want to have dead water, I'm assuming. This uh, is water. Uh, Shoot. Tell you what, maybe we can get a little crazy here. A little touch, a little touch. A little not touch, much. a little, little touch, touch, not much. Oh, it comes is really is this a touch? <clears throat> Start with that, yeah. I'm gonna put just a little pink in there. Like, I like these colors. I don't know if this is what they're supposed to look like, but this is like a stormy unicorn, and I'm kind of feeling it. Because he can just, like, blend this. He even, like, <laughs> <laughs> he even, like, goes a little bit up here with it. I wouldn't. <laughs> but, like, he even, like, I touches, like, the, the, the sky. <laughs> Go for it. You know what's funny? What's that? I mean, I know we're only, like, into the background part yeah. of this, but I'm feeling way more confident because I'm not comparing myself to what I'm actually seeing. I'm like, yeah, you're like, yeah this, this is nice. This looks objectively nice, right? It's all bothers. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That looks nice. Yeah, 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 leave it. Cool. High five. Thanks. Yeah. You know what? I'm glad I watched the whole thing because we were going about this in like not the precise order, but it's okay. I need it's to go okay. in Bob's order. I want to follow the tutorial, it's not that. If you're just telling me like, Oh yeah, there's gonna be a tree here later. Go ahead and do it. But, 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 but Bob says, Bob says, look, I'm gonna quote him. 
<laughs> Who knows? Who it knows? doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Because we can fix anything that can happen here. Because we can fix anything that can happen. We don't concern ourselves with mistakes. We just don't concern ourselves with mistakes. Black, blue, crimson, and I'm gonna get some white. It's gonna be like a drab, blue, wintry, blue color. Load it full of color. Okay. All right, load it up, heavy. Heavy? Load it up, heavy. Paint six trees, and don't worry about <coughs> the ba bases yet, because what we're gonna do, paint the trees, and we're gonna do the thing where we like push at it, and then it fades and blends in. Oh, yeah, yeah, You yeah. know? Okay, so do them about like this tall. Close. Okay. Close. Do, do, do two patches of trees, one over here, one over there. How do I do the strokes? Hold the brush, angle it down a tiny bit. Now when you push at the canvas, push like this. <laughs> so straight in. Not straight in, but he kind of like. You're going to, that, like, that's yeah, a different yeah, motion. Yeah, like like this. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you ready? So, yeah. No, 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 <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, like that, yeah, like that, like that. Trees, no, 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 up, up. <laughs> You're pushing in and then dragging it. Here, here. Here are the brushes and here's the canvas. He kind of goes like this and then like that. So it's kind of like a, yeah, kind of like that. There, maybe another little tree right there. And you decide how many trees live in your world. Oh, I forgot to get skinnier as I went up. up. To you. <laughs> I feel like that looks right. like a tree. Painters are expected yeah, to be nice, different. Nice, nice. <laughs> yeah, and then three more right here. How many trees do we want here? Okay. Now then. I'm gonna take the old two inch brush. I wanna create the illusion of mist. So what you're gonna do, go ahead and take a fresh two inch brush and just stab it in like straight at it and kind of work that color across the base to make it look like fog. <laughs> just go t -t 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 -t. Oh, yeah. a gentle tapping. G gentle tap, yeah. Good stab. <laughs> like this? Yeah, like that. Yeah, mist, mist, mist. You know what, now that I'm just looking at yours, I like it a lot more. More than Bob's? No, I, I like I like I like oh, yours just, more. <laughs> oh, just more than you previously liked? Yeah. It looks nice. Thanks. You know what? Each painting and each painter is Okay. <laughs> That's not the purpose of this video. The purpose is to do it just like Bob. <laughs> or is that the poor purpose, you know? What if this is just an exploration of how art is interpreted differently by different people? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, it's like a game of telephone. Like yeah. from Bob to you to me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll say this. I'll say this. Yours is different than Bob's. It's just like how it's gonna be. But I like yours. I believe in you. Thanks, baby. Okay. The mist is done. Now it's time for something like really exciting that's also gonna be the hardest part of this. You're gonna paint a barn. No, we yes. picked a barn one. I tell you, something man-made, you know? Okay. <laughs> I'm not, I've never been good at doing building. <laughs> like you can be pretty interpretive with trees. Yeah. It's like, well, like, that leaf is just uh, maybe Funky. a type of leaf you've never seen before. Right. But I can't be like, no, the barn's roof's that way. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also very worried because you're gonna want to paint his barn. I want to see your barn. No, there's no barn. There's no barn waiting to come out. I believe in you because you are an artist. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, what do I need? Let's paint an old barn today. One of the easiest ways is to take a scrape out a basic shape. Okay. So what he does is scrapes and sketches a, a, a barn into the canvas with a palette knife. I feel like this is where, this is the point where this is gonna go from looking like something decent to something that like awesome. a child made it. <laughs> this is where it all falls apart. And you're not committed. I like how he's just freaking freehanding a barn with a palette knife in the middle of his painting. Yeah. Okay, is it like a three quarter view? It's a three quarter view. So it's like a triangle, <clears throat> triangle roof, and it kind of goes down towards the back, not, 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 not sloping too much. It's about this big. It doesn't matter. Okay, okay. but it's kind of centered. Barns yeah. come in all kinds of shapes. And then hanging off that first roof is a second roof for like cows. Okay, one thing at a time. Okay, okay. Oh Get geez, oh geez, I'm so, I'm so nervous. I'm so, I'm so, I'm, I, I trust you so much. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
Oh, so 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 the, <laughs> so the, the the A, the top of the A is about right there. Oh, like right in the middle. Right in the middle. Yeah, right there. Yeah, about that big. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's the first part of the barn. He has kind of like a little side structure coming out of the side. Okay. Just let me do this. <laughs> My cabin's taking shape and it's mine now. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay. Okay, okay. So, okay, so now I think I, that's good. Now yeah. I paint. Oh, uh, I think it's palette knife. I think the whole oh. house is oh. palette knife. Oh. You are not committed. Van Dyke Brown, Dark Sienna. The two browns. At the back eave. See there? The little barn comes down. Doop, 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 doop. Gotta make those noises. While you apply the, the paint with that, you need to say, bloop, 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 bloop. You have to do those noises. Okay. Just do the front face first. Okay, maybe I, I need to use the back. I don't get how he does it. Putting in some dark color. See, he doesn't like explain how, how he does magic. You can't use words to say like, use magical Bob Ross powers. <laughs> we'll clean that up later. <laughs> this, is where, this is all falling apart. <laughs> you know what? That, that, that barn has character. I just, I just feel so lost. This is the part of the tutorial where he just like, does it magically. He's like, I'm Bob Ross. There's a barn! <laughs> yeah! Oh, gosh. Hey, it's getting there though. Here we go. Bloop, bloop. See there? You forgot the bloop bloop. Bloop, 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 bloop. bloop. So he did the entire house in that technique, except for the roofs. Mmm, they're gonna have snow. Yeah, they're gonna have snow. Bob Ross is doing dark magic. <laughs> Bob Ross is a dark wizard. But that's a little bit lighter now. Is that better? Well, he, that, that was his original dark color. Yours is a little bit light. <laughs> Sorry, is this stressful or is this fun? <laughs> Just a healthy mix of both. <laughs> it's looking great, honey. He uses that shape knife. I'm not sure if it matters. Oh, you're just not telling me after the cabin? Thankfully, that's not sharp. <laughs> nice, 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 nice. Oh, pro, pro move. Bob, is that you? <laughs> Ow. It looks like chocolate. <laughs> All right, time for the roof. He does an outline of white along the top and on the left side, and then he pulls it down in one swoop, like a little touch more. I always feel like I'm just picking up the color underneath rather than applying the new Yeah, it's color. like, is our, is, our, is our oil paints just cheap? Well, yeah. <laughs> See how it's just like sliding off? I'm trying so hard. To not pull that pink down. Bob's paint knife is like thicker. Maybe he, he can load up more paint on it. He just like knows how to roll. <laughs> oh God, it's too much, it's too much. It's like picking up underneath and I'm just seeing the blue from the trees. Oh no. No, it's just not gonna be single beautiful Bob strokes. Looks great. Oh, except for, no, that's an icicle. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. I'm gonna not get flustered. No. I'm gonna take my time. Yes. I'm gonna apply this precisely and with confidence. Yes, you can do it. Dab, 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 dab. 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 Make your cabin fab. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very nice. Okay, we done with the cabin. <laughs> I don't know how much more I think, cabin I think we need like a little bit of a hug after the cabin experience. Oh, <laughs> ah, ah. It looks like a sad Hershey's bar. <laughs> Decide where your door lives and... He just went, he said, just make a door. And then there's a door. He just went like... Yep. <laughs> 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 it's a little, it's a little like, woo. <laughs> you have paint underneath your eye somehow. Come here, let me make sure it's not too thick. You know, it's just part of your makeup. My new look. look. Your new look. There you go. Oh, oh, wait, wait. You also got some green underneath your nose. <laughs> underneath your There's nose. There's no. Right. Say the old so what he does to clean it up, he takes this knife. See? And he just goes. Chuk, chuk. But yeah, you could do this one like going back. Oh. That's loaded up, or you get your two-inch brush that's loaded up with white. It's got a little snow. Okay. 
Oh. A little snow. Let's go up in This is going to be so interesting <laughs> because it's going to be so dangerous. So you're going to be kind of, kind of like doing a swipe across this. Across the bottom of the cabin? Across the bottom of the cabin. Watch that brown snow. You know what they say about it. He says, careful of the brown snow. You know what they say about it. Am I outlining oh. a hill or am I cleaning up the bottom? Or is it both at the same time? Both at the same time. So he's adding like another sweep right here of white and it's going like, like, oops. Stop touching it! It kind of goes like right here. You're making me nervous. Bob, I have a lot of brown snow. <laughs> Can I like blend out all this crap? Yeah, 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 yeah. Blend, blend it down with the white. I feel like that'll make me feel a lot better. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, my perspective is a little questionable. What's in front of what is a little questionable. <laughs> okay, here we go. Maybe right here. I'll put a little paint thinner. Just I'm trying to like figure out the best way to approach the rest oh, of this I painting. Happy little tree. Okay. Because it's uh, right there. Just we might need to get interpretive. You know what am, I mean? am I that far off? It's almost as important. Wow, as what color are you using? Is it the same as before? I don't know. He's just like mixing them. He's just like. All right. So do a tree. His was like a little more over here, a little bit smaller or something. He he does a tree right there. The His cabin. house I think is a lot smaller. Oh, a happy little okay. tree. Okay, so where am I putting a tree? <laughs> right, left. I don't know. How big is the stem? I mean, I mean the, <laughs> the trunk. So there. Every test. Here we go. So yeah. much fun to make. And they're very simple. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That that's the technique. That's it. So Bob says you can't make a mistake here. Well, I'm going to prove you wrong, Bob. <laughs> I think I've been proving you time wrong this whole time. Okay, so he says, take that gray color you have. He just zoom, makes a path. Like from here, and it kind of gets wider as Isn't it goes out. Is it like a straight way. path or like a curvy path? No, it's like kind of like a shadowy, like rough path. It's not like a straight. Whoosh. Oh, so in the very first, he does it like this. And then he slowly tilts it like that as he goes. This is advanced. His brush is skinnier than his door. So you're gonna have to be careful that you don't make the path wider than your door. Oh gosh. You got this baby. I believe in you. Okay, so it starts out horizontal. Kind of is going back and forth, rotating. But like, you see how yours has like streaks in? I'm not saying it's you. I think it's the brush, the paint, and the canvas. <laughs> yes, it's everything else's fault. <laughs> so, but like, I, I like that it's like uneven. You know, my path is just going to be like more of a shadow than a path. It's a shadowy path. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some highlights on our little evergreens. Let me clean off another spot. I changed the blue. I've been using Prussian blue to stand up. This is a blue spruce. I just made a decision. Command level decision right here. All right. Next, Bob has made a command level decision that these are now blue trees. <laughs> or something like that. Okay. <laughs> Makes a little bit of white and a little bit of phthalo blue. And now, do the same thing as he did on these trees, but like yeah, on the top side, side of them, and, and add a little bit of a blue, snowy is. highlight. And a little tree over here. Don't forget. Sometimes okay. I look over at your face and I get nervous. Yeah, but like, yeah, he's just here. like, and let's just do a little bit of white and like snowy parts overlapping the path. He's like, boop, 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 boop. You know how Bob does. I know. You know, we are mere mortals, Bob. No. Have mercy upon us. And he just kind of went, Boop, boop, boop. Okay, you ready? <laughs> yeah, so it's like now, so what he did is these trees are now on a hill over the path. And then he just starts blending randomly in a few different places, back and forth strokes. Okay. Applying paint from the trees down to the path. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not done. <laughs> And then? <laughs> no, 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 no. You no, said no. back, you said back and forth. <laughs> I'm doing, you said apply his paint from the trees down to the path. <laughs> <laughs> we have record. He just starts blending back and forth strokes. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> well, that, was, that was a mess up. It's a waterfall. It's a waterfall. <laughs> It's a river! It's, it's a river! river. And, he, and he doesn't really he doesn't really curve it. It's kind of like straight lines kind of going diagonal-ish. Oh no no no, no. <laughs> straight. You're curving again. 
Those are straight lines going oh diagonal. Oh my gosh. I think, I think this is one of the most difficult things we've ever done on this channel. Okay, okay. okay. But how, what, what do I proceed? What I don't know, I... I've given you all of the words I have. You said do hills, and yeah. I curved them because hills yeah. are curved. And you said no curves, diagonal lines, downwards. And then I did that and you laughed at me. <laughs> do your own interpretation. Once I stop telling you what to do, then you get better. See, that's already a lot better. I like the direction. Okay. Looks good, looks good, looks good. It looks beautiful. You look beautiful. I right, do the same for this one. That easy. Yeah, same there. See, he sort of sits up high. Isn't okay. that neat? Yeah. Mm -hmm. His path looks like it's now like winding back and forth like. I'll try. <laughs> Where does it come from? <laughs> But just by pulling some of that color that you can create, that illusion. This is all gonna blend to a dang gray. But we are stronger than this, and we will defeat this painting by making it look beautiful. Yeah. You're going down! Yeah, you nice, nice. Your little path. You're doing it. We're doing it. It's team effort. Team effort. Bush time. <laughs> um, let's, see, let's, let's see how he does these bushes. Show us the way. Bring us home. Bring us home, Bob. We'll just pop in a little duder here, a little bushes and weeds. Pop in a little duder. <laughs> kind of just did like a little kind of line and he lifts up. Yeah, little yeah. patches of bushes yeah. and sticks. One right more, a little bit farther over. down. This is the best thing I've done on this whole painting. <laughs> yeah, baby. You're going to be making the big trees now. Okay, babe. big trees. Dark, really dark. Ready for your bravery test? Mm -hmm. All right. This is the bravery test. This is the biggest bravery test yet. It's two big strokes. Two trees? Do you want to just do it in one go? You know what I mean? I think that might be it. Okay, I'm just gonna go for it. All right, one tree that goes all the way from here, all the way down. Yeah, but This like is nerve wracking because nerve -wracking. every time I have tried to do any sort of long stroke, yeah. the paint just sticks and then mm -hmm. fades. Fades, yeah. Be one with the paint. Are you ready? I'm ready. And it gets fatter at the bottom. Yep, it's looking great, it's looking great. Do I stop like here? Yeah. Hey! I can um, do a line. Okay, let's give him a friend. Let's he also starts at the top. Through that thick snow. Oh gosh. Picks up a lot of snow. This is great. Okay. We're gonna be adding snow to the side of the, the tree anyways later. Perfect. I think the choice to overlap your house with the tree was a bold one, and I think it looks really great. Thanks. I think it distracts from how bad the house is. <laughs> no, no, like you, you can't see the perspective issues anymore. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Today's video is sponsored by Squarespace. And you know, you might be someone who's interested in Squarespace. Maybe you are a really good oil painter. Wow. And you wanna showcase your portfolio. Squarespace can do that. When it came time for us to make websites for our podcast and gaming channels, we went to Squarespace because we know that they have everything you need in a one-stop shop to get the whole thing set up. Plus, there's no third-party plugins to install, so you don't have to worry about things breaking while you're off creating content or creating art. Yes. So if you, like so many others, are ready to stop putting your dream aside and make it real, go to squarespace.com slash Evan and Kaylin for 10% off your first purchase. Very nice. Thank you, Squarespace. Maybe this is an old birch tree that lives out here. It's okay, so he gets white on his palette oh, knife, okay. and then he does like little tsk, 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 and he adds a little bit of snow to the right side. Oh, no, 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 not, not, not that. <laughs> Not that hard. Barely touch it, and it should just be like a light kiss. A, a, a stronger kiss. So, so far, do you think this is easier or harder than, than watching it? It's like 10,000 times harder. <laughs> yeah, that's what I think too. It's gonna get even better when we do more details. I'm about ready to eat. <laughs> yeah, me too. Maybe there's a little stick right in there. I don't know. A few little twigs and sticks and things. I really hope you've enjoyed this little painting. I hope you'll try it. Kaylin, this is the final step. All you need to do is add a few little details to this tree, to some bushes if you want, to the bottom. Okay, you touched it like six times. No, you don't get a hug. Mm, I'm sorry. You can add a stick there. <laughs> Bob added a stick there. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, add the sticks. <laughs> In this top section from here up, just add a few little squiggly, like bare branches. Happy little squiggle. So Caitlin, would you recommend this fun activity for people to try at home with their significant other? Yes. <laughs> no! Of every like home DIY, of every project we've taken on, over 120 different projects. This is by far the, the most stressful. stressful and difficult thing we have done as a couple. I expected there to be a little stress, like that tree is a little too big, but not like you ruined the barn. <laughs> I think at the end when you step back, you're gonna really like it. I know that's what happened last time. Yeah, those little details in the trees make this look so awesome. Perfect. Yeah, then now you have to to sign it. Oh my gosh. I really hope you've enjoyed this little painting. I hope you'll try it. It's, you know you can do anything that you believe you can do. <clears throat> let's see what this actually looks like. Well, here, let's, 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 here, step back, step back okay, with me. Okay, step okay, okay, back okay, with okay. Me. okay. Step back with me over here. What do you think about that, like, as a painting, as like a piece of art? You know, from back here, it only kind of sucks. No, it looks pretty good. Like, like the gradient in the background. Like, what part? What part do you like? What part don't you like? I like the. I really like the foreground trees. Yep. I really like the tiny shrubs. I like yep. the snow. I like the foggy trees. <laughs> Can you guess what part I don't like? You don't like the barn. I don't like the barn. <laughs> <laughs> it could be worse. Okay, let's show you the. Let's show you his. Open your eyes. Oh man. This is so good. It looks very Wait. similar. Oh my gosh. Those trees. Holy crap. I know, right? They're so <gasps> thick and luscious. They're so thick and luscious. I think it's just further proof that Bob's a wizard. Yep. We are just mere mortals. You did you did good. You did Thanks. good. Like <clears throat> I, I feel like we did get it pretty darn close. Pretty darn close. Would I recommend doing this where like you can't see a Bob Ross tutorial and you're having someone describe it to you? No. No, I would not recommend this. <laughs> well, I mean, it depends on what your goal is. Depends on what your goal. Are if, you going to strengthen goal, your communication? <laughs> if your goal is to stress test your communication skills, then it's a great stress tester. This is the most stressed we have been in a long time. <laughs> yes. But hey, we, we pulled it together. Yep. We got teamwork. Teamwork. Something came out the other side. <laughs> and? Maybe we'll give it to one of our moms. They'll, they'll, they'll love it, it no matter what. <laughs> All right, guys. Hope to see you next time. Bye. Bye. Check out our gaming channel. Look at that. So pretty. Ooh, ooh. That's nice. I know, but Caitlin. Much rock. There's there's a problem. What? Not a big problem. We just need. Well, our torches aren't centered. <laughs> I'm gonna fix those. I'm gonna fix those.